Why do you think there are so many browsers out there which does almost the same thing? Well, all of them help access internet, right? Some of them are even open source and many developers are actively involved in its development. Have you ever thought how does they make money? Well, they have tracker scripts to track your data. That way they know a lot about you, your likes and dislikes. Based on that, you get to see ads from their partner advertising company. They make billions in revenue, by the way. Well, what do you lose? Your privacy, your bandwidth. Due to unnecessary loading of ads and trackers, it's estimated that a single person loses about $300 every year. That's a lot of money. Your browsing experience gets cluttered. You'll be targeted by marketing companies and some of, somehow they will try to sell, sell you something. Sometimes greedy people implement malwares into your computer to extract or rather steal your data. Brave browser prevents all these things very effectively. Well, most of the big companies sell their users data. Some years back I got my credit card and the same day I started getting calls from companies who provide loans. I opened a DMAT account, a trading account and, and these signal guys, trade signal guys started calling me. Well, how the hell they got my data? With browsers, you visit an e-commerce site. They start showing you their site's products all over the place, even inside your emails. They track you down and show you these ads, whichever sites you visit. Recently, even Facebook admitted that they confessed that they, they track users even when they are logged out of their Facebook account. That's ridiculous. You are not a product. Why use a browser that treats you like one? We have a better decentralized alternative. Be brave. Use brave. It's fast, at least 8 to 10 times faster than Internet Explorer and 2 to 6 times faster than Google Chrome. It's more private and secure. You will fall in love with this browsing experience once you start using it and I'll show you how. There are over 4 million active users and it and it made to top 10 list in 21 countries in the Play Store. First version of Brave Browser was launched on January 20th of 2016. So today is 22nd October 2018. So in such a short period of time, it has achieved a lot. You can start downloading the browser immediately by visiting the link you are seeing on, the, on your screen. That is technotip.com slash brave. It will take you to their official website you can open it using your Android mobile or iOS mobile, Windows, Linux, computers, desktop or laptops or tablets, anything and click on this download button. So well, what is this? It's easy to support Technotip on YouTube. So Brave browser supports publishers because it doesn't show ads that way publishers get, get to lose the motivation. They don't get the revenue. So Brave shares revenue with them so it's good for even publishers so i am one of the publishers you can visit this link coinmarket.live slash about and check all of our social channels be brave start using brave browser which doesn't collect your data and sell your data instead it pays you for using it yes it pays i'll show you how i'll open the brave browser well we have an update here just click the update button. It will turn off, it will close the browser and in the background it will update it within few seconds and reopen itself. Now let's see the version we are using. Click on this three lines button help and about. So look, it's using V8 engine and Node.js. Now I'll go to the same link and open the settings i'll go to this payments tab where we'll set up our set up our wallet well brave will give us some tokens for free to get started you can't store it and use it for yourself you can only give it away to any publisher if you don't it will just get expired so i'll show you how to claim that just turn on this brave payment button here, toggle it. 
Now click on claim my free tokens. Once you click that, you'll have to prove that you're human by the way. Drag this brave bat icon on this yellow triangle. Just follow the instruction. You'll have to drag it to different triangles. So you got 25 bats for free, which you have to give away to any publisher you like. You can't withdraw it by the way. So what you can use or withdraw is go to shields. In ad controller, you can select show brave ads. For all the ads you see, you will get the cutoff and you can withdraw that and use that money. So it's still in beta. So you start using this browser and you'll, you'll start seeing the ads in coming days. So this is my channel, by the way, I'm one of their publisher. I'll show you how you can contribute to me. Tip me for that. You can visit technotip.com slash YouTube. You'll end up on this page itself. Click on this heart button and turn, ish, turn it yellowish. That means payment is you are enabling payment to this YouTube channel, by the way. I have so many educational videos. All are free, freely available. So I think if you tip me with this, I'll make use of it and produce more of the videos. You can even set the percentage of bat, that is percentage of reward you want to give me automatically. So I'll set it, I just set it to 100. You can set it to whatever percentage you want to give away. So if you don't use this, it will just expire. They have even given you the date when these 25 bat will expire. Bat means basic attention token. It's a token for your attention payment for your attention so the inside shield you have show brave ads whatever bad tokens you'll get out of this you can just cash out that and use it so i'll i held the most important feature of this browser for the last part that is private tab hold control shift and press n and you will open a private tab and it has Tor network built in. You can just enable it and visit any of the websites. Even if your ISPs are blocking it, you can easily seamlessly access it without using any custom private VPNs, virtual private networks. You can use this private tab, which has Tor built in. You can use it and access any of the sites online. So please, download the browser and by the way it's from the guy who, the same guy who built mozilla firefox so he knows his stuff he's not new to it he has been in this market from decades he has he had worked in netscape and then he founded the mozilla foundation and the same guy quit the mozilla foundation and started this brave software so you are in safe hands and this Brave is open source. It's built on V8 engine, the, the same engine which Chrome uses, but the mechanics are different here. The motto is to provide private, secure and faster browsing experience for the users rather than tracking you down and showing you ads and making a hell lot of money for themselves. So I would recommend you to start using this Brave browser on your phones laptops desktops tablets or whichever devices whichever os you are using start using brave browser and i'm sure you will fall in love with it thank you